And they've been watching these very dramatic pictures at the White House. Uh, President Obama uh, made a call to the Oklahoma governor, Mary Fallon, uh, this evening, um, directing the uh, Federal Emergency Management Agency, FEMA, as it's known here, to uh, provide any assistance that uh, she needs there in Oklahoma. FEMA has sent a special team to Oklahoma to uh, uh, work with the Oklahoma Emergency Operations Center. Uh, but uh, the focus right now, as you were saying, on the um, Plaza Towers School, uh, where it's thought about 75 uh, children and uh, teachers had been sheltering when this twister came through. Now, uh, there are uh, images of uh, some children being brought to safety, being uh, uh, passed along a line to a triage centre there, but there are also thought to have been uh, children uh, it's been confirmed, in fact, that there were children who uh, perished in this uh, extraordinary storm. Um, we don't know how many yet, but um, within the last uh, hour or so, 51 people are known to have died, according to the uh, state uh, medical examining officer uh, in Oklahoma, and those figures are expected to increase as the uh, night goes on, Mike. And David, as you've been pointing out, this is an area that's seen many tornadoes, or 50, of course, in the past 24 hours. But the biggest one, I think, the strongest wind speeds ever recorded on the surface of the planet back on May the 3rd, 1999. But it seems this storm just too big for most people's shelters to cope with. Well, you know, what's amazing is that um, although they are used, as you say, to uh, tornadoes in this part of the world, uh, your uh, a previous uh, guest there was uh, talking about how they have facilities in place there and uh, many people have cellars in which to uh, uh, to, to um, hide out and while these storms pass. Um, fewer than 1%, uh, I'm told, of, uh, of tornadoes actually reach this sort of wind speed. And we're talking about uh, 200 miles an hour there or thereabouts and uh, you mentioned 1999 well that was when uh, this town of Moore was devastated um, with a, a similar tornado uh, more than 40 people lost their lives in that there were thousands of buildings that uh, were destroyed well now it seems um, the town of Moore has to rebuild once again and it would take many weeks if not months